Thanks, Aaron. We're on location today at Alderson Elementary School where they're having an extra special holiday lunch. Not only are families invited to the school today, obviously, but they've also partnered with the Chef Community Council for their fourth event of the year. Back in the summer, we picked themes for every month and we decided December was gonna be frozen because of Oslo and Olaf, and so that's the reason we picked an elementary school. The uh, Elsa and Olaf are from Estacada Drama Department. So what are we, what's on the menu today? Today we have a lumpa, which is a potato pancake made with rye bread with the grilled hot dog, and then we have the Norwegian meatballs, and Norwegian pickles, and some um, baked apples. It's all along the Elsa and Olaf Norwegian type food. There's not too much food in the movie, so we went with uh, Norway, a lot of fish, but since it's elementary, I don't think they'll like too much fish, so we went with stuff that's fun for them. Flavor just a little bit different so they can taste some different spices and everything. Every event has a different local chef. Some of us are retired like me. I've done one event. Um, chef Esteban today is from Raider Ranch, and he also did the beautiful ice carving here today. That's one of the reasons we wanted him to do Frozen. I haven't done one in like four or five years, so it was fun to learn how to ride a bike again. I think it's very important to have the Chef's Community Council because it gets people in the community involved in these schools. It's also to expose the children to different ingredients, different types of food throughout the year. What's been the best part about having these events for y'all so far now? This is the fourth one. I think the best part of it is that now we're getting the hang of it. Actually, this was a nationwide event for Aramark that was kicked off a couple of years ago, and then we had COVID, and so they weren't able to do it. And so I think we're setting the standard for the mid-sized market. And next month, the Chef Community Council will hold their event at Lubbock High School, where all of the food that's going to be served um, on that day is going to be all produced within a 90-mile radius of Lubbock High. So that'll be really cool to see in January. Aaron, back to you.